but I'm delighted to be here as it's the 28th Commonwealth Agricultural Conference. And a very big thank you to those many individuals from Canada, the UK, and elsewhere that have been working together to plan and put on this event. And since 1963, these conferences have been held biennially in Commonwealth nations around the world. And it has given the delegates the opportunity to share the ideas, the networks, learning about agricultural industry in host countries, but also sharing good practice and ideas at all levels. So the 28th Commonwealth Agricultural Conference 2018 will mark the conference's fourth trip to Canada and the second visit to Alberta. And Alberta, as we've been hearing, does provide uh, an extraordinary backdrop to dis international discussion about food and farming. Yet they're still facing many challenges here, including a farming population which is growing older, so getting new blood into it. Farm succession, which is a challenge I think that faces uh, all parts of the sector. And facing up to land access, dietary fashions, uh, environmental influences which are perhaps not terribly linked to the practicalities of farming itself. But it is very encouraging to see so many young people here with us at the conference because it's their understanding of innovation and technology which will drive where this goes in the future. So developing the next generation of agricultural leaders is critical to food and farming and I think is, is one of the aspects in which this conference and the RSE in general really has an enormously good story to tell 